So good morning everybody. It's a wonderful to be here this fine morning. I am Raju from English department. I want to say about Gandhi on his the shyness my shield. Mah- Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi was the preeminent leader of the Indian independence movement in British rule India employing non-violent civil disobedience Gandhi led India to independence and inspired movements for civil rights and freedom across the world he is also called bapu in India so mahatma gandhi by name of mohandas karamchand gandhi he was born october 2 1869 porbandar india and died january 30th 1948 delhi he was an indian lawyer politician social activist and a writer who became the leader of the nationalist movement against the british rule of india he wrote many books such as all men are brothers gandhi's autobiography the bhagavad gita my story of my experiment with truth and autobiography truth is god and satyagraha in south africa i want to summarize the main idea of the essay shyness my shield the lesson shyness my shield is taken from gandhi's autobiography my experiments with truth gandhi was famous throughout the world for his creative weapons of non violence and civil disobedience to fight against any government for the rights of people in the present lesson shyness my shield he depicts his experiences in london gandhi was selected to executive committee of the vegetarian society in london he made it a point to attend every one of its meetings but he always felt tongue tied it was only in south africa that he got over his shyness though he never completely overcame it it was impossible for him to speak impropt he hesitated whatever he had to face strange audience and avoided making a speech whenever he could Gandhi says that his constitutional shyness has been no disadvantages whatever he admits that his shyness was once an annoyance and then a pleasure Gandhi points out that he was laughed at for his inability to speak on public occasions even when the audience were not large in number however he asserts that his shyness has been no disadvantage whatever on any occasion in fact his shyness has been all to his advantage his hesitancy in speech which was once an annoyance is now a pleasure its greatest benefits has been that he has formed the habit of restraining his thoughts experience has taught him that silence is a part of spiritual discipline of a watery of truth proneness to exaggeration to a suppress or a modify the truth wrongly and 
unwittingly is a natural weakness of man and silence is necessary in order to surmount it a man of a few words will rarely be thoughtless in his speech as he will critically analyze every word we find many people who are eager to talk all this talking can hardly be said to be of any use to the world it is sheer waste of time gandhi sinesh has been in reality his shield and buckler it had allowed him to grow more over his timidity to deliver a speech has helped him in his discernment of truth the president of the vegetarian society was mr hills proprietor of the thames iron works he was a puritan a controversy arose regarding the religion of vegetarian fair for advocating the then birth control movement mr hills regarded it as contrary to the puritan ideals so mr hills wanted to suspend dr religion from the committee of vegetarian society even then mr gandhi did not make a public speech he remained quite reticent this shyness gandhi ji retained throughout his stay in england even when he paid a social call the presence of half a dozen or more people who dislike gandhi dumb his last effort to make a public speech in england who was on the eve of his departure from home it was in the hornbourne restaurant while bidding farewell he spoke the first sentence and could not proceed further thus his shyness was no disadvantage to him finally gandhi explained how he turned a disadvantage in him into advantage gandhi said we must be the change that we wish to see so this is the wonderful lesson from the gandhi he explained the bitter experiences into sweet experiences experiences to us throughout this lesson thank you anandal thank you